Biblical manuscripts can come in various forms. Manuscript simply means written by hand, and often we find with the Old Testament things are written on leather uh, until you know the la last few hundred years when uh, people write manuscripts on paper. But uh, on the whole, it's uh, uh, leather in for the Hebrew Old Testament. With the New Testament, um, there's an, a period for a few hundred years when people are using papyrus more than leather. Then leather becomes very popular, and then uh, finally. Uh, paper, paper takes over, but um, manuscripts can take various forms. You can have 500 page long manuscripts, or you can have a manuscript that's just a little fragment, uh, you know, uh, just the size of a coin or a postage stamp. And so when people try and count how many manuscripts there are, this is one of the difficulties that you're not really counting um, the same sorts of things. But um, what these are enable us to do is have a, a picture overall of how we got the text uh, over time. Um, they're spread out in many different places. And of course, amongst the manuscripts, it's not just that you have Greek for the New Testament, you also have lots of other translations. Um, with the Old Testament, likewise, the Old Testament gets translated into Greek and then to Latin and to other uh, languages. So, in fact, um, it's possible to look at the history of the whole biblical text uh, over many, many countries in many languages.